Welcome to Life Manage Lab, where we're continuing our in-depth look at the Physique Smart Weight Management System. Today, I have with me Dr. Natalie Chevreau, Senior Vice President of Research and Development, also known as Dr. Fifi. So today we'll be going through the Physique Fat Burn, which contains the patented ingredient Sinitrol and such, how to help you shed those unhealthy pounds. Dr. Fifi, can you tell us what the target is for the Physique Fat Burn? The target is to get rid of this abdominal fat, which is so hard to get rid of. Can you tell us what the benefits are when taking the Physique Fat Burn? Again, it's to get rid of the abdominal fat, this toxic abdominal fat that we're look, looking here, like gone, while maintaining the lean mass in your body in a safe and healthy way. When most people think of fat burners, they think of unhealthy dietary supplements loaded with stimulants. Can you tell us what the difference is with the physique fat burn? Yes, physique fat burn is not loaded with stimulant or any mega quantities of caffeine. In fact, it has less than 22 milligrams of caffeine per serving. And it has what nature has best to offer, the polyphenols from the citrus fruit, guarana, and green coffee beans, which really help the fat metabolism. So on the label, these patented blends are called Zvetol and Sinitrol, and that's what you will see on the label. So can you give us some more insight on the Sinitrol ingredient? I'll be happy to. So Sinitrol is a patented uh, extract of citrus fruit and guarana, and what it does is increase the fat breakdown in the body. So think about Sinitrol as the key to unlock the fat which are stuck in the fat cell. Then as the fat is released, you're going to be able to use it for energy and lose fat mass. Was Sinitrol clinically tested? And if it is, can you give us the results? Yes, uh, Sinitrol has two clinical studies which are published and available on PubMed. The latest study has 95 subjects that were split into two groups, a placebo group and a Sinitrol group, lasted for three months. The people didn't know what product they were getting, whether Sinitrol or placebo, because the capsules were identical. And they were asked to eat between 1,800 to 1,000 calories per day for the women and 2,000 to 2,500 for the men. And the only change they were asked is to add 10 minutes of work three times a week. And then what the results show is that the Sinitrol group lost more fat, especially abdominal fat, than the placebo group. So if you look on the screen right now, at the top left corner, you see the graph of the reduction of abdominal fat. So the red bar is Sinitrol group and the gray bar is the placebo group. You can see the difference in the two bars showing a 254% greater reduction of abdominal fat uh, in the Sinitrol group over placebo. Then if you look at the lower left corner graph, which is the waist circumference reduction, the red group lost more than the gray group, the placebo group. In fact, 263% more uh, uh, waist reduction over uh, placebo. That represents two notches in uh, somebody's belt. And then if you jump directly to the lower right corner graph, this is the free fatty acid which are in the bloodstream released from the fat mass. You can see that Sinetrol group lost much more or was able to have much more free fatty acid available in the bloodstream showing that the fat mass was being taken apart and thus this free fatty acid would be used for energy. Dr. Fifi, can you give us some insight on Svetol, what it is, what it does? So Svetol is the patent pending uh, green coffee bean extract, which has been processed in such a way you have a high level of what's called chlorogenic acids. These are uh, specific uh, type of polyphenols. This is not your common green coffee bean extract that you find on the market. And what it does, it works differently. It has a different mechanism than Sinetrol. It helps controlling the blood glucose even though for those who have normal blood uh, glucose. So the combination of the Sinetrol and the Svetol together is the best that the world has to offer. Is Svetol clinically tested? Svetol has also been tested in a double-blind placebo-controlled study. In this case, again, same thing, 1,800 to 2,000 calories for women, uh, 
2,000 to 2,500 in men. It was only a two-month study. In this case, no change in physical activity was required. So if people were sedentary, they stayed sedentary. We can lo also look at the result, and you will see on the screen the result. On the left side, you see the weight loss after 60 days. So the Svetol group lost over 10 pounds, whereas the placebo less than 5 pounds. But more importantly, what they lost is they lost more of the fat mass and maintain more of the lean mass in the red bar group, which is the Svetol group, versus the placebo group. And we know that when we go on a diet, we tend to lose our lean mass. In this case, by taking Svetol, they were able to maintain more of their lean mass while they were losing their fat mass. Dr. Fifi, you've included some B vitamins in the physique fat part. Why were they added? So you have B3, which is also known as nicotinic acid or niacin. You also have B6, folic acid, and B12. So I put B3, folic acid, and B12 for our friends, customers, vegan, because mm -hmm. these are coming mostly from animal-based products. So we wanted to make sure for our vegan friends they were taken care of. The second thing is I put folic acid and B12 specifically for our customer who are in childbearing age. And finally, I added B6 because B6 is very important for amino acid uh, metabolism. And when you go, you start going, paying attention to your weight, you tend to eat a little bit more protein. So I wanted to make sure there was plenty of B6, which is important for amino acid metabolism and protein metabolism. So the physique fat burn contains less than 22 milligrams of caffeine. Is that going to be a problem if I take Axio or Axio decaf at the same time? No, because, so 22, let's say for the calculation, if you take two servings of fat burn per day, that's, let's say, 40 milligrams of caffeine per day. So then you have an Axio huckleberry green grape or the sour cherry, which has 100 milligrams of caffeine. So 100 plus 40, that's 140. That's even less than um, a coffee cup at McDonald's or the tall latte grande at uh, Starbucks. Then if you add the axio decaf of the uh, red raspberry, which is only 13 milligram of uh, caffeine. So now we are looking at 153 milligram per day. Mm -hmm. FDA recommends no more than 400 milligram of caffeine to stay on the safe side. So we have 153 if the people take our three products. So we have plenty of margin of safety in terms when it comes to the caffeine content. So that's the physique fat burn, which combines the wisdom of nature with the reliability of science to help you shed unhealthy pounds. Thank you for joining us for this edition of Life Vantage Labs. If you have any additional questions on physique fat burn, please visit us at lifevantage.com where you can download our FAQs. Don't forget to watch us next time as we go over the physique protein shake.